Yeah. So, sir, you're the head of the Kazakhstan Antitrust Authority. What are your plans for Kazakhstan Antitrust? Like, um, oh, uh, plans for, for this year or in general? In general, yeah. Well, we uh, have a big plan for Antitrust in Kazakhstan. Uh, the agency was just, um, it was just set up over two years ago as a, an independent um, agency. So, uh, yeah, we're trying to bust those uh, monopolies as we discussed before. Yeah, like Kazmanaigas has all the yeah, energy. I was, yeah, as I was saying before, it's not just uh, private monopolies that we have a good, good track record of uh, demonopolizing the last three years. Yeah. But uh, I was saying before that the other issue now is that we have a lot of SOEs and state presence in the economy. Yeah. And company dimension, uh, oil and gas, and mm -hmm. um, other um, uh, sectors, railways, oh, telecom. Yeah. So the problem is we don't have enough private enterprises in the, in the economy, so that's what we're trying to do. And then you have the oligarch problem, which all the former Soviet Union has. How yeah. are you addressing the oligarchs? That's sort of, will you be breaking up their things so they have to do well, a spin off? We, and we, are, we, we are in the process of doing that. Already we have some good results. Uh, uh, taking those assets back to the state, yeah. uh, which were um, uh, privatized uh, in um, no, bad valuations and yeah. uh, uh, illegal say, privatization. Thing. So we're trying to uh, get those assets back to the government and do a more proper, proper transparent uh, privatization. And because w the fact that I haven't read about this in the Wall Street Journal means that you've been doing a very good job. I mean, it hasn't been like, you know, the oligarchs. I mean, you had the big scandal with no, uh, no, so the, the... Yeah, so far we're trying to break up the oligarch uh, uh, structure of the economy, uh, focus more on SMEs, Yeah. Uh, obviously private enterprise, not just through privatization, but uh, through open options, yeah. uh, even state support for everybody. Uh, we call it uh, favoritism to make sure that uh, uh, if a company gets state support, the uh, subsidized loans, it's mm -hmm. fair and transparent. Uh, okay, and you're learning from American and European examples, yeah, yeah. best practices? OECD and other international research like ICN. And the U in the U.S. we're here to study um, Biden's degree in competition, yeah. which was, I think, signed a couple of years ago. Okay. So we're attending few events, trying to learn uh, how to institutionally um, develop our, our agency. What do you think of the mass of the criticism against our head of the Federal Trade Commission, Lena Khan? That must be very surprising. Well, I don't know really much about her, her and her remarks. I don't really follow uh, Yeah. in terms of, uh, especially in the last two, three years, to make sure that uh, they're in line with best practices. And my last question, which you you may play a key part in because of the importance of Kazakhstan in the oil and gas sector, yeah. when something like Exxon may take over British BP or ENI, these major oil and gas mergers, mm -hmm. it will be you who says yes or no for yeah, the merger. Yeah. Is that? That's why here, where we're here, we're trying to uh, increase our uh, capacity and capabilities within the agency. Yeah. And try to introduce better economic mm. analysis. Good morning, good morning. And better economic, econometric models to actually uh, see whether a certain merger will be good for market. Yeah, like Exxon, BP is a big uh, yeah. gas oil, ENI, the Italians have Kashigan. Yeah. So those are mergers, like same thing that would happen with Mozambique when Anadarko tried to buy. Uh, yeah. yeah. So what we are, we are so, uh, um, but that affects your. At the end of the day, uh, what's best for consumers yeah. and the economy <laughs> in general it will be uh, our main priority. Have you approved or disapproved any foreign mergers yet? Uh, <laughs> yeah, we've disapproved some foreign mergers. Which uh, ones? Uh, I can't remember. Because, like, we have a lot of uh, <laughs> okay. uh, filings, especially in the last year. But yeah, some mergers were blocked, some were actually uh, given a green light, but with some certain conditions. Uh, and obviously, well. Leniency programs and compliance programs. No. Yeah, instilled. How about the Microsoft Activision? Did you rule on that? 
No, no. <laughs> it, it wasn't in our jurisdiction. But, yeah. It's an interesting case. I know. So I mean, everybody else did. Yeah. Brazil, yeah. South Africa. But, uh, it was not in our jurisdiction. Okay. Very well, small open economy, I don't think we have it. Even in Microsoft. Agriculture, oil, yeah. gas, your major. Okay, thank you, sir. Right. Thank you for the interview.